Whoa, hello friends, this is Jeff playing Ultimate Admiral, Age of Sail, British campaign on hard land and sea, and as I say, it is hard. We do have a D modifier here of cost me plus 30% ship repair costs when I have to repair my ships. And this is uh, version um, 9.21 revised 35981. So the game's, you know, constantly updating and they make things even harder and stuff like that. So anyways, this is Siege of Tolan. Let's go ahead and give it a shot. So anyways, how's everybody in the world doing? Are you guys having a good old time or what? Do you like this game? Do you have this game? Do you enjoy the game? Just pop a comment once in a while and let me know if you enjoy it. But anyways. Okay. So we can put five ships here. So yeah, I don't even... I. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I have six ships. Oh well. Yeah, I miscalculated this one, that's for sure. I mean, I would have taken the guys off one of these ships to load them up on here, so. That's a goof on me. So, but anyways. Okay, so I'm thinking I'm going to need my rookie units and these. I'll take these big boys. Yeah, I mean, so technically I could have used 150 of these guys on one of these ships, but oh well. And that gives me 2,382. So, here we go. Yeah, meanwhile, like I said, I, okay, so yeah, they, if I do this and we see what we're going, okay, so now we're going to pause for just a moment because these guys are going to be getting destroyed. So let me see what we got here. Now, we, I know that there's going to be three lines of infantry that are going to overtake this. He can hit that one. Oh, and that's a, a movable one. He can hit that one. And you can take a shot at that one. Oh, and you, you can't take a shot at any of them, so that's too bad. All right, so now I guess we're going to have this one move. Let me see if I can see this correctly. All right, we're going to have that one go there. And this unit's going to go right there. This one's going to go here. All right. And then while that's going on, I got to unload the ships. So, I mean, this is just going to take a moment to set up. Sorry that the opening is always kind of weird. All right. So let's go to Whitby and unload. And Fox. And Victoria. Mary and Rita. 
I think that's it. All right, and now what we want to do is I want to tell these artillery to move because we don't want them to be taken. And do I have everybody? Oh, except this unit here. All right. We go right there. Okay. So I think we got them all moving. Because like I said, you stay here. All that artillery is just going to pound any unit. And the whole point of this battle is to um, hang on to these allies. I mean, you can leave them here, and but you'll lose them. I, I, I you know, I, I know for a fact that you'll lose them all. So, <laughs> anyways, now while that's being done, I need to I need to get these guys here. So let's go ahead and do that. Just take a moment. And like I said, I, I know. This part of it is not fun for people to watch, so just fast forward past all this, if you like. And all of these guys are going to have a hard time getting on this. And my other thoughts of this battle while I'm trying to get these guys to get over here is... The way the wind is, it's hard for us to get a ship over here. It's impossible. The ship ends up bouncing and going way over here. So, I mean, it's no point of of trying to do that. So, I, I, I just can't get a ship to go on the right. Because so I've tried this before. And, and I think they made a change to this battle, actually. If you don't take that flag, you, you get a defeat. I mean, before, you didn't even have to get that flag. So I think that is one adjustment that they made to the battle. So, because um, I've already played this, testing it out, and um, I didn't. I just killed them all, and I didn't take the flag, and I and I didn't look at the thing, and I I went and finished, and it gave me a defeat. So I mean, so this. So you're seeing my second play on this. Um, but now Rita, I'm going to see if I can get Rita to move. You better put this up. Is everybody moving? How are we over here? Yeah, I mean, they're going to go slowly. And th these guys are going to have like three waves of like 12 units, I think. And then with the mobile guns, there's two mobile guns that are going to come. So anyways, all right, we do have some guys. Now let's get you guys moving. Oh, you have only 44, so you go over there. Like I said, this is going to take a while to set up, so... If you don't like that, you can, um, I'm going to get reader moving. Okay, now we're, we are getting some of these guys, so, all right, let me see if I can move. I want to get these organized. Now this 81 can go over there. Now, okay, now these two 64s, I think I should be able to merge those. Okay. Oh, my 320, get over there. All right, so now reader is in shallows. Yeah, I know. Okay, now. Come on, reader. I want to make sure everybody now. Um, I don't want you there. I, I, I need you. Um, 
How about... Uh, I don't even know. Right over there. Ammo can go over there. All big units to move, but anybody small. And of course, you guys are having a difficulty, of course. Anybody else swimming around anywhere? Nope. Okay. All right, now, Rita. Let's see if I can get Rita right there. And that would mean Mary. Mary can move out. I know we're on shallows, but I see ocean here, so. Boy, is this gun taking a long time to move? He's probably gonna get destroyed. I mean, man. Oh, is that a game bug? I mean, look at, look at all these guys here. There's no reason why this unit can't be moving. So that's probably a glitch, and now I got this guy that's having a hard time landing. So can you land over here somewhere? Alright, now I need to get my mortar moving, so let's get the mortar over there. Alright, well let's try to de make a defensive line. Oh yeah, that, that's a game bug. Come on. Yeah, I'm going to lose an artillery unit. Why can't you move? I mean, this is ridiculous. Game glitch bug right there. Gee, I wonder if I should just... Oh, and then where are you going? You were supposed to go over there. And... All right, Mary. Let's go over here. Mary... Yeah, so, okay, we're going to lose one artillery. I mean, ally artillery. You know, and then we got these uh, glitchy things that happen in the game where um, the ships connect to each other and then they start turning and there's just no reason for it. Like, I, I did, not, did not select that ship. I mean, that ship should not have been turned. But anyways... Now, Fox, unfortunately, where Fox is located, uh, Fox is not a ship that has guns. But I'm going to see if I can get her to come along that way. Yeah, I've seen the game ain't even let me do that. Okay. So we already know we're going to lose that artillery. That's disappointing. And you need to be turning that way. So let me see. Now, I'm sorry for pausing and all that stuff, but... Oh, he's finally moving. So move down here, please. Hurry, before they come. All right. Sorry that I... I, I hope I'm not sounding like I'm angry, but... I just don't like um, glitchy things and when the game kind of screws up a little. They haven't taken the flag yet, so that does allow this gun to get into a position. I'm going to see if I can put it right there, actually. It might be able to get an angle shot. These three should be in a position to be able to shoot. Alright, yeah, they... 
They got it, which is okay. Alright, now I think I put my mortar right about here, maybe. And I'll have this unit right here as support, along with... I think I have another one, where is he? Right here. Okay, he's gonna move up to there. I'm gonna think about what I wanna do with my my good marine units. Now these are seagoing guys, so they can get over there, go over here, support him. Ammo goes whoops, ammo goes by the guns. Okay, now what is Rita doing? Rita can't Oh, cause the wind is look where the wind is. Man, this is ridiculous. Yeah, see, I think they deliberately did this so we can't use our ships. I mean, the, you see, so that's a change in the battle. Like, I really think that... Because I know m people used to tell me that we can go to the right here, and you just can't. I mean, if, if I try to get a ship to go that way, I'm going to tell you where it'll end up in the battle. It'll end up over here somewhere. And I know that that we're waiting for these ships to get past us. That's the whole point of this, this mission. But as you can see, hey now, I could... Okay, so with this ship right here, if I can see this, I can shoot at it. Okay, so, all right. Unfortunately, Maybe Rita could go there. Let's see if Rita can get there. I mean, this is all, like I said, I'm sorry, folks, for the way this is setting up. You're going to have to fast forward if you don't like this, which I wouldn't like it either. Now, I'm going to try again. Like, this ship should be anchored, so if, yeah. I don't know. Let's let's stick with. Let me get it going. Let, let let's stick with this. I'm leaving. Matter of fact, you guys, you guys head over here. I'm gonna take my best marines. Up, oh, and I got one right over here. No. Oh, he's from the Whitby. Yeah, yeah. So he's one of them. Okay, over here. I wonder why he's not three stars. Oh, must be the officer. Lousy officer. All right, now they're setting up. I know they they've got they're gonna have. Oh yeah, here's one right here. Is he gonna come down and attack us? Wow, look at that! Look at the size of those guys. Alright, so whoever we see, they're gonna shoot at. And I got my mortar here. Uh oh, friendly fire. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. And go over there. Friendly fire. Alright, I'll have my mortar start firing. All right, so let me go ahead. While that is going on, how are my ships doing? Oh yeah, and you are gonna go ahead and hit my other ship. Gosh. All right, so I think if I can get Rita there, that means both of these ships will be able to shoot at that once I see it. As a matter of fact, Oh, no, you won't, but you can. So let me... Yeah, you, you're anchored. Can you shoot? Oh, yeah. Let me... Let me anchor her. Can you... Can you shoot at him? Oh, man. Not quite. Let 
Yep, that really sucks. All right, well, you're gonna have to get over here then. Like, I know this ship, and before this ship can reach just a little bit of that. How are we doing here? Like, the whole point of... Yeah, still friendly fire. How is friendly fire? All right, then you move over here. Come on, move, fox. Ready. All right, look, you're gonna have to shoot at him, or you're gonna have to shoot at him. I think he's hitting the wall here or something. All right, so while that is going on, let me try to... And, and you still haven't landed. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Come on. Oh, finally. Okay. Alright, so can I... get... well, maybe... maybe these two are one star. They should be able to merge. We gotta get this guy out of here. Okay, um, let's, let's, Fox, <laughs> I didn't, I don't know, let me see here, um, we have an opportunity to shoot that artillery right there, okay, so. So Fox is going to probably get beat up a little bit. Now, you guys are going to head over here. So we got to give sight over there. And I think Andrew's to you go over there to help him out. Fox over here. Smith. All right, let's do that now. Let me see if I can get a uh, fox to go over here. Because this ship has no guns and it's no point, and then maybe I can get Victoria over here. But yeah, see the way the wind is going, though. Um, They're, they're reshifting. Like I said, I got all the all the artillery supposed to be shooting that artillery. Now, once we knock out that artillery, well, if he's blocked, then move, man. All right, 
Oh, Fox, you're really taking a beating. Something's making him waver. I wonder if they have an artillery over here. All right, now that we are pushing that line back, we still now have to concentrate on that artillery right there. Okay, we wiped out one of their artilleries. Okay, that is good. Now he's coming back now. I wonder if he can shoot at this one. I'm not quite certain. All right. Now I got all these guys over here. So let's see if we can, we can get over here. Because we're still not seeing anything. Because I, I need to get these ships to be shooting over there once we open that up a little. Oh, they brought in another artillery. Okay, hold on. <laughs> oh, I just see it right here. They brought in another artillery right here. Okay. So look. I know you guys like to shoot at infantry. But we got to concentrate and take out the mobile artillery. What about you? Right here. That was my mortar. Let me see if I can get my, my mortar to hit it. My mortar will have to move up a little bit. Alright, so with my Ricky units here, we can go ahead. Oh yeah, look at that. Nice. Oh yeah, but see, their their artillery is down to 24. So I mean, yeah, he he really hurt this unit right here when he fired. But 
Oh, and this one's already shaken. Okay, darn. Okay. All right, look. Smith and Davis. You guys have got to... Yeah, I know he's blocked, but this guy's retreating, so you'll be able to do it. Just follow orders, please. Oh, and I got a gun right here. I didn't even see that. All right. Get over there. All right, well, that's going on too. Um, now, can I... I wonder if they see us. Yeah, that I don't know. But I'm gonna have these guys move. Cause I need to get sight of that so we can shoot. That, that's just a, an experiment for me. Okay, so. No. It's gonna be tough again, but Victoria, you need to at least start heading that way. See what we got here now. Okay, Smith. You and Davis go right here. take a moment to try to shoot that artillery right here. They charging us. Okay, good. He walked away from it. And we wiped that one out. Okay. Okay, so now that's going to change anything because it looks like they had three mobile artillery units. We wiped out two here and we pushed him off this one. So that's three mobiles and does that mean they still have three here and three here that are stationary? Whew, okay, so... Okay, so the problem that we got right now is these guys pushing down on us. So I want all artillery and everything to shoot at them. And the mortar to shoot at them. We gotta push them away. Fall back, uh, fall back. Man, why did you go way over there? There's somebody in front of you to shoot. Just like right there. Come on, shoot him. You, shoot him. Man, we gotta actively shoot these guys. Yeah, come on. Artillery, you need to do much more than what you're doing. Alright, you. Move over here. Oh, they got a coastal gun shooting. Yeah, 
everybody. Shoot him. Alright, good. We wiped out that artillery guy. I mean, please... Shoot him. All right, now, now with all this artillery close up. We should be really pounding them. But we, I'm, I'm, you know, I, like I said, I, 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 I could have uh, went not as far as I did, like up here in the middle. I think. I think I could have pulled them back a little ways try to just work on the first line but you know I chose to oh okay now hold on we got something going on here how come we don't even have vision man all right like I'm just discovering this at the moment like yeah it doesn't look like he can man I don't know if the wind or the tide is moving like Man, and I'm disappointed that... But then again, if we come over here and they come after us, that might be a thing to do. So let me see. You go there. All right, let's see what happens. I mean, we got to have some kind of sight. I mean, this is ridiculous. All right, now what happened? Okay, so we're going to, oh, any any unit moving forward, we got to just put the artillery on them. And, and that big one, matter of fact. Man, they, they keep rotating down. They keep covered. But like I said, the closer they get to the artillery... And the mortar. Now, I cannot believe that I'm right here and I do not, like, okay, do I have to bust out a skirmisher? Let me see. What I don't like about skirmishes is one shot from a cannon and they're destroyed. Okay, you. 
Get over here. Alright, I still don't have sight of that. I mean, that is really frustrating. Okay, oh, and hold on. I sent the ship. Oh, yeah, she's way over here. Great. Great. Uh, not good. Darn it, I forgot about that. Okay, so that's a goof. I should have put always as a pointer. If you're going to send the ship out this way before you want to turn them, put an anchor on them so he stops here and then turn. Because what I did is I kept it moving thinking that I was going to go come right back to him, but I got distracted by the battle. So, I mean, so no, it's no big deal. I mean, the ship only has 40 on it. But um, I don't know if you can see. Oh, and we lost an officer on here. How the heck did we lose an officer? Huh. That's weird. Okay. Well, we're going to just see if I can... I, I don't think I'll be able to, but... It's going to withdraw in a minute and a half. And it's no big deal. Like I said, it's no big deal. I don't really need it. The only other ship that has guns is this one. So I will... Send it right there with an anchor. And then I'll try to get it over here to see if it can do anything. I don't think it can. But it's got a good reach. Like, look at this right here. It's pretty good. But I'm going to go ahead and... Go back down like this so I can see what's going on here. All I'm trying to do at this point is maintain this line... But they're trying to get back their line. And so I need all the artillery to shoot at one of these so we can try to, like, um, for them to be um, disbanded, I guess. The only thing is, I'm going to have the mortar hit that unit there. Okay, so let's do it. Yeah, see, there we go, there we go. Now, once that mortar hits him, he'll withdraw. Yeah, come on, boys. Just... Yeah, I'm thinking we need to concentrate on anybody. Alright. I want you to go there. Alright, and you don't need to be in the corner anymore. They don't have that artillery, so back off. We just got to hold... I, I just want to hold the line here. So I have my two rookie marine units. They will stop anybody from coming to the center. Smith? Um, it's time for you to run. Oh my gosh, get out of there. All right, look, you got to kill that little unit right here. That one right there. I want him dead. Can you shoot that one? Yeah, good. Oh. Now, everybody work on either one of those. I don't care, just... And my mortar should be able to take him out. As a matter of fact, I want mortar on that one.
Okay, we're gonna see how fast we could. Oh, I was I wanted that big unit to stay there, but anybody who thinks they're gonna charge us, we're gonna have all the artillery hit them. And I'll have the border fire. Okay, now you're out of ammo. You can get down here. Yeah, we definitely want to hurt any unit that is big, I'll tell you. Because they're the only ones that could really rush us and push us off this line. Okay, now we got to try to concentrate on small units now. Because we want to just destroy them. Oh no, we don't we don't follow. You can see the shield right here. I had him where he was supposed to be just holding his position. And instead he was moving forward to chase the guy. We want to hold the position that forces them to come down at us. And and I'm wondering too if maybe when I finished uh, before and I got a defeat was because maybe all those ships didn't retreat. Like I, I didn't check to see. Because I thought we don't really have to hold this. But the, the objective does say to hold it. Okay, I want you to come down into the woods a little bit. Smith over here. Come on, mortar unit, hit him. Uh oh. Oh. Alright, that guy needs the ammo now. Supply needs to go over here. So, I gotta have my front guys, they gotta have ammo. Alright, now, so another ship retreated, so let's take a look. So here's another one. Alright, I did say I was going to try to get this ship over here. That's what I needed to do with... Yeah, this one retreated. Darn it. Oh, well, that's okay. I'd be disappointed if I really needed it, but...
friendly fire. Now, how could... Oh, because of my ship shooting. Silly ship. Oh yeah, look at this. Oh. Yeah, I have to watch the arc. Ready, ready. Grenade is shattered. All right, look, guys, focus on the people that are coming at us. All right, you two focus on that one. You focus on that one, and you just hold until you see somebody coming. All right, so this 92 you can shoot at, okay? Move up a little bit. Ready. And fire. Oh yeah, look at all that. Look at all that. my mortar shoot at that one. Come on, mortar, you can do better than that. Man, total misses. Ugh. Okay, that one's gone. He decided he's moving in. hold we just want to kill as many units as we can No, no, mortar, stay, stay, do not go past the infantry. <laughs> they will still come down at us. They, they want to pull that flag and all we got to do. Matter of fact, I can move that artillery, I can move this artillery. I probably can move this artillery.
And it's disappointing once they get over here, they don't have that long arc. I told you to hold. Yeah, I already lost one more guy because of him moving forward. Now with all the artillery closer, we should get better kill rates, yes. Alright, now, Ashford is empty. So I'm gonna send... Uh, you two can go over there. I'm gonna see if I can fill up Ashford from here. I can't remember if a supply wagon can get filled from a supply depot. We're gonna find out. Because he's empty anyway, so... Now, I'm gonna p tell everybody to just hold, because I just want them to hold position, and then... Whoever gets into the range, they should automatically open up on them, I would think. And the, the enemy still has the tendency to want to... Oh, and look at They brought over a... <laughs> they must have brought a unit from over here or here. Because look at that unit. Is that a fresh unit? Let's look at the objective. Now it says victory conditions hold Gibraltar, so yeah, even I think with the ships that... I'm thinking that they changed it, right? Because you don't see any more ally ships, right? This is just, you know, like I'm just... I, I talk to this like as if I'm talking to you guys, so that way you can leave me a note. But as you can see, I don't see any enemy ships. I'm not enemy, I'm the ally ships, so therefore... Before, you could finish this battle without taking Gibraltar. But now, it, it appears that you have to, so... But we should have time. I'm, it's not. It's only uh, 9 in the morning, so I mean... We should have plenty of time. And my point is, I just want... Matter of fact, I want this artillery to shoot at that 273 unit. All other artillery will shoot at somebody that's close. Along with my mortar. Because we just gotta bust these units, I mean. All right, if you can't really hit him, then hit that one. Yeah, I guess we'll hit the units that we can actually hit. Let's concentrate on the smaller units. Let's go, let's hit this one. Let's hit that one. Come on, finish him off. Finish him. Okay, more coming in. Alright, let's, let's get ready for that one. Alright. Let's get ready for that one. And that's why you want to watch them, because you don't want one of your units to follow them up there. 
as long as I see units up here, like you said, you can fast forward. I mean, but you know, I mean, I, I am having fun. So I mean, you two, I don't know what you guys are doing, but um, you can come down here and get ammo now. Can you? Yeah, yeah. Look, look. It it looks like. He might be getting ammo. Let me see if I can put him right there. Maybe be closer. It looks like it'll take a long time though, but... It looks like it's possible. It, it might be. We'll see. Now, I haven't even done this part yet. But it's only because... Hey, my ship is shooting. Like, that ship is shooting. Look at it. Yeah, like if he can shoot at that one, that would be great. All right, look, we need to we need to shoot at the rovers. If you look at it, these guys are just holding the line. But the rovers, they seem to want to come down. Alright, so now we got that unit. Come on, guys. Open up on them. We're just trying to destroy the units. And it's interesting that this big one here, like... Matter of fact, nobody's hitting him. He's still 2-7. But I think, like I said, I'd, I'd rather have the artillery shoot at these smaller units so that way we can at least try to destroy them. If they could get a shot off. Okay. <laughs> Everybody, shoot at the... Th the 37, right here. Shoot at the 37. Ah, he's backing off. Darn it, he's backing off. Alright, just, sh just shoot at whoever you want to shoot at then, I guess. I don't know. Alright, let's check the status of this. Yeah, look at it. Only, it's only gone this much. You got ammo, and you got ammo. Yeah, it look, it looks like it'll take forever for that supply wagon to fill up on ammo, but it, but it can. It looks so that's an informational thing, I guess. Now my mortar is going to be getting out of ammo and this cannon still has ammo, that one does, that one does. Come on. Oh yeah, okay, so somehow my mortar moved up a little bit. So we lost a few guys. I mean, if we lose 20, we lose the gun. 
if you lose 25 on a cannon, you lose a gun. So I mean, so I think uh, you need to you need to at least go right here, maybe. Ready. Because yeah, I, I don't want to lose 20 on him because I'll, I'll have to pay for a gun. Yeah, I didn't like I said in all this that I've been messing around and I didn't pay attention to him. So yeah, I just want him to hold in this position. Somebody walks into his range, I welcome him to shoot, but do not follow anybody. And these two marine units that were 320, they're now 191 and 160, but at least they've, they've kind of held this area. So I mean, it's more than what I could ask of them at the point. And now we just have... I don't know if you have him. Can you hit him or are you hitting the ground? Let me see. I just want to watch this one for a moment. Okay, that one can hit him. Right, I'm going to move this artillery to over here. Let's do a little bit fast. Oh yeah, these are two different type of units. They can't merge. Oh well. Oh, he's from Victoria and he is... Oh, I see. He's a Fusilier. Alright, well you got ammo, so you go up there. What are you? You're a Fusilier. Alright, and... You go right there. I know, I'll have you go right here. Come on, let's get there. So you definitely have ammo. I got ammo. You got ammo. All right, I'll have those two come down and get ammo. Yeah, now look at, uh, my question is, are they getting fresh units or are they keep bringing units from over there? Is what I'm thinking, like it's either or. I guess what I could do too I mean, it's going to be a slow process, but I could move the artillery one by one down to get more ammo. Because this one is, you know, it's taken forever for him to fill up. He is filling up, though. I mean, he was, he had hardly any, and 
and now he's got this much. It's at 84%. And I mean, this video is going to drag out. I, I realize that. But like I said, you always have the option of seeing what you want to see and fast forward. If you want to hear my commentary as it goes, you know, you can. But um, And to me, that's okay if if they dropped one unit out of here and here because when I do this attack here maybe there won't be much here I'm not sure like that's still yet to come I mean um, it's only what time is it? it's 1030 so now oh man you you're already full all right you can get moving yes now see how fast an infantry filled up look at that I mean, yeah, they had about 25% ammo before they got here, but, um, yeah, they filled up. Look how fast that was. Now, what about this? Uh, hey, I told you to move. Okay, so there's a couple of units that shattered, which is nice. I'm not even looking at it, but um, I just want to see how much ammo you got. Yeah, so those are some big units. All right, well. Another one shattered. Okay, well, let me... Let me get Buford up here to see if he can resupply these guys. Is it easier to do that? Let me see. He's got maybe 25% supply right now. This is down to 79% maybe. But cuz yeah, they they brought they brought 3 units, maybe one from here and two from here to hold the flag. So do you see how they want to hold that flag no matter what? So yeah, now but now I got to just work on them, I guess, you know. But you two, I'll get you two over here because you guys now have ammo. And like I said, I haven't even used my four marine units that I have from the Whitby. But I plan to. It's just that... Um, this, like I said, is a way of... Okay, so ammo is here. So now uh, we'll be, yeah, look at this, Bennett. Bennett is already, look at the supply he's gaining. And I'll move Bennett up a little bit. Okay, so we can go back to normal speed, I think. Right, and my mortar can hit that unit, and then all the cannons, all the cannons will work on that unit. And this one, I don't think he can hit that one, but I know he can hit that one. He should be able to. Let's see. Hey, look at all the look at all the dead bodies. <laughs> Look at all that. That is quite a bit. Woo! That is quite a bit. Yeah, see, he can hit over there, so that's good. All right, I think, uh, how, how is he doing? Yeah, look, at he's still, he must hold a lot of supply. I mean, he's supplying. I'll move him just slightly over here so he can supply this one, too. But yeah, so even having just a quarter of his supply is enough to... 
Uh, hold. I don't like the mortar moving too much, man. Hey, you know what? Um, we might, like, he's right there. Yeah, if we can bust him out of there, we can go up and get that artillery right there. So that means I'm going to want all the artillery to hit him. All artillery. We just got to get him to move. Man, all those rounds ain't even killing anybody. Alright, if you can only shoot at him, you shoot at him, and... Alright. Yeah, maybe if I have this one engage him. And have this one take that. Because we got to at least claim it. Telling him to move over here out of the range of this guy, and he's shooting him. All right, then then move over here. Like, see, this is what I don't like. Uh, when they get hit, they tend to go towards the enemy. I mean, that's something that they still have to repair in the game. And this is always the problem when you grab an artillery when it's near an enemy infantry because this is what happens. And, and it's just an example to show, I guess. Although I did claim the gun, so that way I will get a... I'll get one in the uh, rewards now that I claimed it. But as you can see... I mean, I knew... I knew that this infantry was going to be a problem for that. But I thought he would engage him, but he didn't. He still engaged him, so that was just a bust. That's okay. So now I'll move my guys here. I mean, I'll eventually get that. It's just a matter of time. We need to just uh, work on these other units. Okay, like I said, it might be boring to you, but like I said, um, I just am trying my best to not get a lot of my own guys killed, but um, this is a battle. Let's see, it's 1140, so I believe we still have time. And like I said, if these guys can't... Oh, uh, ammo is out now, so he can go back over here and try to fill up. And the mortar has... Yeah, look at all the ammo the mortar has. So at least my mortar can continue to fire. Oh, and look. My mortar is up to a thousand kills. Okay? 
and he is a he's a fresh unit that I built out of an out of one of my marine units that's why he does have three perks and I will just tell you this if you if you happen to be watching this and listening to me at this very moment I might have said this before but uh, in the American campaign but I'll tell you in the British campaign now that this logistics it's only 5% but it gives I don't know the actual percentage but it gives 20% extra ammo to this unit by taking that if you take stamina or morale yes you get still you still get 5% efficiency but you get uh, morale or you'll get stamina or whatever but when you see that this just says logistics and you only get 5%, you wonder um, you're getting ripped off because you're not getting two things for one. But you're actually getting 15 to 20% extra ammo. So um, I'll, I'll just tell you that. That, um, that I know because I tested it in the game and I know it works. I had, I had two units that had... Um, the other perk and one that had this one and I had them both firing at the same unit and um, one of them ran out of ammo before the other one did and that's why I, I tested it. Now in Ultimate General Civil War I'll also tell you that that ammo perk does not work. It works for the first battle that you fight in and then the next battle it doesn't work. And Panda has addressed that and can't fix it so um, I'm just giving that information as something to give, I guess. Alright, so now I think this guy can go over here and get this, maybe. Let's see. Come on, get that. How is he blocked? Man. Alright, well if he's not blocked, then shoot him. Okay, so you're getting hit, so come on down here. Come on down over here. And of course, the enemy is shooting. Now the question is, is the is the artil their artillery hitting these units? Hey, yeah, and if I can get him down here, that would be perfect. Get right here. Right about there. Yeah, so if I keep these two units here, we, we might claim the flag, and... That would mean... So artillery can go there. Alright, look, you guys have got to move a little bit so you all can shoot. Okay, now hold. I'll get my mortar right there. So, all right, well, I think that will... That will be enough to... Uh, I'm thinking having all these move up a little bit once they get into position. 
they will be able to shoot these guys. And that'll be that. I mean, I can't imagine having all these like, right here and these guys want to engage, but... Mortar right there. You right there. All right, so now I think what I can do is, because I can get that flag. Yeah, I even got the flag right now. Okay, so now I think I'm going to direct my attention elsewhere. I mean, they'll they'll keep, but like I said, uh, I think these guys can, can do it. Now let's take a look and see how the supply wagon is doing. Yeah, it got very little. It takes so long. It's too bad. All right, so now I'm gonna, I'm just gonna see, cause like I said, I can get that flag. They don't have any giant units over here anymore, so. And he'll, and he can't, cause the moment he gets over, he's gonna get hit by all that. So now, let's see, who do I wanna send up? Well, how about the skirmisher? Okay, so now my ships can shoot at him. Nope. Alright, so I can have my ships shoot at him. At least we can take that gun out, maybe. Let's see. Let's see. Now, what's going on over here? Anything? Oh, but they are... I think somebody over here sees him. Please tell me that you're shooting him. Uh. Oh, look at this little battle here. So he obviously fired first. What is this fuselage loaded with? Well, that was interesting. <laughs> Little tidy units shooting each other. And anyway, so it looks like... Okay, so now we don't have any others. There's one, one unit over here somewhere. And if he gets in sight of this one, these guys will open up on him. But it looks like we might be getting hit by over here, I think. 
So, up oh, now. Here we go. All right, let's watch this for a second. Twenty-four against twenty-four. Depends on who has the better weapon and the efficiency. I guess. He does have two stars. He only has one. This is absolutely fun. <laughs> Come on. Hurry up, reload. Okay. Discipline. So he has discipline training. Eighteen to thirteen. All right, we got him. Yay! All right. So I don't think any of them will. I think that's it. For the units that were over there. So we have one infantry, two guns. I know we're gonna probably get hit by these guns over here, but I'm gonna go ahead and give it a try. So you two. Yeah, they're hitting us, but I got no choice. Now, what I could do is take this unit and go up by the flag, and maybe they'll direct their attention to him while I attack these guys. I don't know. But Oh, they got one infantry right here. I didn't see. Alright, we're pushing them off. I mean, it's going to be a costly uh, affair, but... Um... Oh, and I got one over here. Holy... Alright, get over here. 
All right, I actually had one unit over here that I wasn't using. Oh, man. Okay. Well, the ships played a little role. I mean, they were they, they shot. Look, you can see all these rounds over here. So, I mean, they, they, they helped a little bit. So, all right, now you shoot him. Well, let's go ahead and... Hey, look, they're coming this way. Look what they're gonna walk into. Okay, oh, let's see what I can do now. Um, oh, hey, wait a minute. Why can't my ships um, now hit these guys, right? Now, this ship, maybe you can, you can turn a little bit. Let me see. Where's Carter? Carter over here. Right, I'm going to see if I can have him shoot that artillery. Okay, so we're not really doing a good job of hitting their artillery. I mean, they're still at, you know, 74 and 47. Okay, he's gone.
Hey, you know what I probably could do right now? I probably could get, um... Yeah, why don't I bring these artillery back up? That's a four-pounder, though. That's a four-pounder. That's a 12-pounder. So, yeah, why don't I put the 12-pounders up there so maybe we can also shoot at their artillery. Now that we can see them. And this supply... Yeah, he's putting direct shots on my artillery, but... But we haven't hit him. I'm wondering if it would have been better to take this one out first and then do this one. Um, I don't know, like, I'm trying to think. Like, I've been having the artillery. He's still 70 and 47s. So I mean, nothing has changed. Okay, now, you shoot that gun there, you shoot that gun right there. Yeah, and they blew us right off the gun. Okay, you get over there. All right, well, let's see what we're going to do. Hey, are they shooting at us? Look, guys, um,
All right, so now I think I can get this unit over here. And yeah, by by the artillery hit in this one, it destroyed this 12-pounder over here. Oh well. And once we kill this unit, I'll have those two units go over there. Yeah, this is going to be a very long video, but I'm going to go for, let's see if I can go for total annihilation. Like, I can't tell which one of these, there's two 12s and probably one 4 here, I would think. These twelves hit that one. Okay. Okay.
All right, well, it looks like now I got their gun. I can use that against them. Well, this is going to be a victory. And it looks like I get total annihilation. So sorry that the video is going to be a million hours long, but... I mean, this was under hard, so... I'm going to get full rewards. Now, where are we going? <laughs> Do I have to chase them all over the place? We're just going to go fast. Alright, um, I think that's it. Okay, very good. Okay, well, like I said, I know it's going to be long, but... You know, I had to do it. So now, let's take a look at this got the conclusion okay so 11 ships but I only had five so I don't know exactly how many I had but this accounts for all the uh, ships that retreated that's why don't be deceived by 6,972 there is no way I had that to fight this battle no way but look what they had they had 5,758 and six guns they lost, they lost it all basically. Um, my fleet, I lost 722. An army that they gave us, the Allies, we had 18. So I don't know, like I didn't, I don't recall what I put in here, but you could see at the beginning of the video how much um, my my actually my five ships totaled. So the rest was all the Allies that were just retreating, and we just had to hold Gibraltar. And I did, and I got the victory. So we lost probably 1,238 of the uh, Allied infantries and one of their guns. The golds, yeah, hold your bolter. Like, I'm telling you, I played this uh, earlier yesterday or whatever, testing the battle out, and I can tell you that if you don't... They, they made this major... This is a major change to this battle. Um, if you don't get back that flag you get a loss where before you could you didn't have to get it you just had to wait for those ships to retreat and then you got a victory whether you held the flag or not so to me like if I'm wrong you can go ahead and correct me but I'm going to tell you that I got a defeat on this uh when all those ships retreated and I just said ah finish and I thought oh, I didn't have to come up there and get that flag and I got a defeat so uh so, so, I, so, th so that's why I'm just giving you that information. Okay, units. If you like looking at this, you may...
Oh, that is a lot. That was a lot. Yeah, this battle was long. I'm going to have to hurry up and conclude on this. So, yeah, if you can pause the screen if you like looking at this. I'll scroll it one more time. That is a lot of units. Officers. Oh, I lost a commander. Not good. And this guy got wounded, so he won't get any XP, so that's not good either. Oh, well. That's the way it goes. Now, we did get 605 of these, which is not bad. I mean, any gun with a musket is it's pretty good, even though it's a junky gun. You know, so anyways. All right, well, that was that. I'm happy to get a, a victory out of this, folks. I'm not kidding you. And if you, you know, you watch some of it and you heard my commentary, um, you know, so, okay, so here's the thing, right? Luckily, my ships didn't get damaged in this battle because look at this, this negative modifier. Costs me 30% more to repair a ship. So that's a negative, I mean, but anyways, okay, looks like I got a hundred prisoners. I lost an officer, so I'll put a lieutenant there. So let's look at our ships. These ships were 350, so they're not bad. Um... I'll leave them for now. And look at this one. Oh yeah, this one wasn't even in the battle. Okay. This was a ship that just wasn't in the battle because I thought it needed six. So I had prepared six, but I only needed five ships. And we didn't lose a unit. So that is all good, but we lost an officer. I'll call him um, what he what the name is. Uh, let me see. El Elliot. Okay. All right. All right. So I didn't lose one of my units, so that's really great. And this mortar killed over a thousand of them. So that is really good. So yeah. And no repairs on ships. So that was the Siege of Tolan. This is what I got for rewards in one career point. Yeah, let's see, what do I want to put it on? I mean, I still have to buy five. And if I put it here, it'll only take one off, but... Yeah, I think I'm going to go one more in tech. And that dropped it to four instead of five. So if I could put two more in here, maybe I can I drop that to two. That I'd have to buy two before I can go over here and get the artillery. I think the artillery is here. Yeah, right here. But anyways, um, all right, that is that. So now the only thing we got left, uh, like I always will end with uh, after doing a point of interest. It's only 92%, but let's do it.
All right, I'm gonna go ahead and take one rep to sell the prisoners. So Lost Souls gave me 10,000 and five reputation and only medium damage. So at least we got a little bit of money in rep. The Europe Herald on February 6th, 1794 for his role in driving the British from Tolan Napoleon Bonaparte is prompted to brigade, oh, to br brigadier general at the age of 24. With this promotion, he assumes command of the artillery of France's Army of Italy. All right, so now uh, I gotta repair the ships. Now, of course, I'm paying 30% more to repair a ship, so that kind of sucks. But that is it. Okay, so folks, that is it. I'm going to go ahead and and save the game. And, and I'm going to go ahead and uh, tell every one of you that I appreciate you guys who do watch me and stuff. Thank you so much. I hope no matter where you are in the world that you're doing great. Have a wonderful day, morning, afternoon, or evening. God bless to you all, of course, in your own religion. This is Jeff signing out. Adios, amigos.